What's up, guys? It's your boy, Barca Boy 103. We have some big news breaking out this morning ahead of the match against Cadez later on, and that is that Serginho Des set to join PSV Eindhoven on an initial loan deal with the buy option and has been confirmed by everyone now sources in netherlands sources in barcelona and also for bitch romano gave the here we go as well but the initial report came in from tony juan marti he's come out saying that sergio des joins PSGB eindhoven it will be a loan with an initial buy option for 10 million euros the dutch club will pay only half of his salary and des will travel to eindhoven in the next hours to undergo his medical test and sign the agreement immediately now this did come out a few hours ago sorry i was uh sleeping you know i'm not up at 4 a.m refreshing twitter nonetheless i think now he is in the netherlands and he is signing the agreement doing his medicals all that sort of stuff but the operation is completed loan for the end of the season by option but half the salary is covered by barcelona which is a bit annoying overall though most important thing is getting rid of the player we're at a point now 10 days left in the window maybe 11 days left in the window where you don't want to, you know, risk it. Of course, maybe he goes out there in the PSV in the Netherlands, does well. He's joining, he's joining the champion. So in retrospect, hopefully that will help out get good performances from him. He's on a hundred thousand a week, I believe. So we are going to be paying fifty thousand a week for him for the entire season, which doesn't really bode well for Barcelona. I was hoping that if, if we're doing a loan, that either the opposite team, whoever it was, would cover his full salary, or maybe Des would have gave up that other half that that we were supposed to cover but he hasn't which again i don't blame him for whatsoever 10 million by option is oh is a uh, you know pretty decent as well hopefully that can be activated at some point but the most important thing was getting rid of deaths and now we've done it the rumors about deaths over the past 24 hours have really intensified recently there were talks about uh, psv there's talk about nice there's talks about premier league club so once the interest came in for Des, it was very easy for Barcelona to get rid of him. Of course, we were talking about over the past few weeks how there was no interest for Des. There was absolutely no club in the world that wanted him. PSV didn't ask for about him. Then Nice, Barcelona were talking about both of them for a loan. I think Bournemouth came in for a bit and another unknown Premier League club came in as well discussing the opportunity to try and get him on loan. When they were talking with PSV Barcelona, they were trying to even get him away on a permanent transfer, but no agreement was reached. They looked at the an agreement on a loan, so Barcelona just took it, which, again, do not blend them whatsoever. With Des, again, he's, you know, surplus requirements at Barcelona. He isn't at the level that we uh, expect from him, especially when we initially signed him from Ajax for around 23 million euros. He was given the chance in preseason, I think mainly because he was American and we're going on an American tour. We just need that American face, essentially, but he was given the opportunity and he failed with absolute absolutely flying colors and the reality is that Chavi never trusted him never backed him from the beginning he only gave him the opportunity because we were kind of broken the market if he came you know good we didn't have to invest in a right back so to speak but he didn't come good at all very very poor in preseason at the end of the day he came out before preseason doing an interview with the Portivo saying that uh, I'm, I'm gonna be given a chance it's now up to me to you know prove everyone wrong to prove that I'm a Barcelona player it's now in my hands and if I do it great and if not we'll have to analyze my future and in the end he did it I think PSV honestly is a great move for him going back to a league where you know he grew up going back to a league where he you know earned his move to Barcelona speaks the Dutch language as well and he's going to the best team as well I think they also do lack a right back as well so I think this would be a good move for all parties the, the only thing now we have to wait and see for is if PSV will buy him next summer again it is an option to buy not mandatory it cannot become mandatory if he plays 20 games or they win the league or whatever the case may be it will be an option at the end of the season so we'll hear more rumors about this probably around you know may uh, june time and that's what we'll see if he's gonna come back to barcelona or not i think we're gonna be at a point next summer where you just want to cut ties with him completely um because he cannot do three loans in a row we're gonna be at a point where we're gonna be loading him out for his rest of his contract which is could be an option, but it's just unfeasible for the club. You know, keep him, let him train, then possibly take him on preseason or not, then let him go. So I do wish him all the best. I do hope he does well there because I do want PSV to buy him. I think, again, 10 million euros for him is a good deal for Barcelona with his, you know, current situation. You pay 23, you get 10 back. I think there's been, uh, I think AC Milan paid a loan fee, if I'm not mistaken. Maybe they didn't, but you only lose about 15 million euros on him and, you know, I think what he did in that first season with the Coleman in the second season was, you know, worth 50 million euros. So hopefully that is the case. But anyways, deaths to PSV, done deal. That's now another player 
out for Barcelona. A few more to go. According to reports, we're trying to get rid of Clement Longley and Marcus Alonso. Let's go. But we'll wait to see how that goes. So a few more sales left to go for Barcelona, but another one out the door. And that is Dest to PSV. Let me know your thoughts down in the comments below on the entirety of the operation. Your thoughts on Dest's future. Think he'll come back. Even PSV will end up buying him. And also your thoughts on the condition of the deal. Of course, half of the salary will be covered by Barcelona. The option to buy it being a loan itself. Leave me all your thoughts down below. And of course, make sure you subscribe down below as well if you haven't already. And I'll see you guys later on for the match against Cadez. Take care and force the Barca. Barcelona, Barcelona.